Over the last few days, I've been playing around with Scarlet and Violet in the Go DLC, finding out some new features and some new stuff to play with. Today, I'm going to show you the new lock-on feature. To unlock this, you need to progress to unlock BBQs, which are different things, different quests, as you can see here. Uh, way to get different Blueberry Academy points or Blueberry Quest points. These points are accumulated and you can unlock different things. Uh, you open up this menu once you unlock it by pressing the right stick on your D-pad. Um, and they will change every time you upgrade them and you will continue to upgrade these throughout play. So you get more with better VP and different types of um, quests. So once you have enough BBQ quest, which is 200 points for this new lock-on feature, you want to fly to the entrance of the Blueberry Academy. You want to fly to the blue, uh, entrance of the Blueberry Academy, and then you want to go down to our lovely uh, League Club Room. This League Club Room is where you basically unlock a lot of stuff for... Um, a lot of stuff for the DLC. Um, and for us, we're just gonna come here, we're gonna come to the screen, and we're gonna unlock by saying contribute BP here. And when we contribute BT, we're, BP, we're gonna go to the new lock on feature. So this is gonna unlock the new lock on feature. It's gonna bring up some messages. And it's gonna show that you can see more details about the Pokemon lock-on using the L button. So, as you can see here, the new lock-on functionality allows you to see the Pokemon size, see the Pokemon if it has a mark, uh, but it's only for species you've caught before. So, a lot of you are mark hunters, a lot of you are shiny mark hunters. So, wouldn't it be nice to see a shiny if you caught it with a mark and see what size it is? I think this is one of the features that a lot of people have been looking for. And I think this is going to help us get what we need. So to show it in action here, I'm just going to go to the terrarium. Just go down to the terrarium here. So I make I made a grass sparkling level 3 sandwich with Taro level 3 as well. So see, that shows that there's a mark on a Pokemon here, right? So we caught this execute right here. It has the Dawn mark. So as you can see, you can see which Pokemon actually have mark on it. The size is on it, and that is so useful for mark hunting. So let's see if we can quickly get the shiny here. And there is the shiny execute, guys. You see how it doesn't have a mark? But now you can tell, and instead, if you didn't want to catch this, you can move on. But for example, for me, you can still catch this, right? And um, no, that is not going to be a big one. It's not going to be a small one, and it's not going to have a mark. And so, when you're hunting, you can use that to quickly judge which Pokemon you want to catch, which ones you don't want to catch, and you can continue uh, moving on with your shiny hunts. So. This lock-on feature is going to allow you to quickly continue what you're doing as well as you're just mark hunting. If you're not just shiny hunting or mark shiny hunting, you get a lot of this kinds of Pokemon, you know what I mean? So if you enjoy content like this, make sure you like and subscribe below. 